It's my feel good breakfast show. This is your Feel Good Breakfast Show, Expresso. Thank you so much for joining us on this Monday morning where we're talking relationships with our resident relationship expert. Dr. Eve is in the house to make sure that uh, we get some answers from her about yeah. your questions. 083-9133728, that's what you need to call. We've got Anonymous on the line. You live on your Feel Good Breakfast Show. What's your question? Hi, Dr. Eve. I'm a fan of yours. Go on, ask your question, please. Uh, I'm married for 25 years. And I'm having a problem with my partner. Uh, she, uh, we just can't get along. And she has different values. She likes uh, more material things. And I'm unemployed and she's keep on uh, being a nag to me. So I'm just concerned. I think I should uh, uh, call it quits and end the marriage because I've just had enough. Yeah, I can hear you sound incredibly despondent and despairing about it. I'm sure that those traits were there or that behavior was there. Maybe now your situation has changed because you can't provide for her any longer. And you should go into counseling before you decide to part. And I'm not saying you shouldn't part. After 25 years, you may very well feel like you want to be doing that. Mm. But really find out if this is uh, the best solution for both of you mm. to, to, Dr. Get, to, to finish it. I immediately, thank you, Anonymous, for your call. Yeah. I can hear you still there. But we're going to mourn the questions as they're coming through. I mean, we're talking here about people that feel controlled by a partner because yeah. they're saying, uh, I want to change something about you. What mm. to do? Feeling controlled is the most desperate situation to be in. No one should be controlling anybody in a relationship. Mm. And if that's how you're feeling, that's really going to be one of the largest red flags. Mm. It's about not wanting to change. One has to hold on to oneself in a relationship mm. and feeling that you are out of control and the only way you can be in control or feel secure is when you control or restrict somebody else is a very unhealthy way to be managing a relationship. I can also hear from your relationship advice that you don't always think separation or divorce is an answer, that there needs to be some kind of communication. Immediately I think of, if you guys are too different, where, where mm. do you compromise? I don't believe in compromise at all. I use the word negotiation because that means two people have parity. They're both equal in the relationship and they both have an equal say about what they want to have in a relationship. Compromise always feels, I am giving something up in order to please somebody. And when you do that, you feel very unhappy. And resentment then builds up. And that's not a good way to be able to live in a relationship. When we dish it out, we are able to yeah. say to someone else uh, that we, uh, I don't like something about you. Should we able yeah. to take it back, like receive it? To be able to get that back yes. as well. I think it's so important that people sit down together mm -hmm. as a couple and go through what's called a contract every few months to contract things that irritate you, things that are pleasing to you. Don't mm. forget the pleasing part as well. To be able to say these are things that this month, because we keep changing, we're evolving, mm. we're organic. Doctor, thank keep you so much changing. for joining us on our show this morning and for answering our questions. To Anonymous and everyone else that has contributed, thank yeah. you so much for calling. We really appreciate it. Keep that number handy because she'll be back. 83 913 This is your Feel Good Breakfast Show. Where is the team? Where? We're right here. You know what? And I just want to tell Idris, I will never try to change him ever. <laughs> ever. I'm wondering, have you figured out your favorite song yet? It's very difficult at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's got one. He's got one. He's at got the one. moment, I'm listening to something that I discovered, but it's so old that no one knows it. What okay. is it? What is it? Sing it's it. a band called Rare Earth. Rare, okay. Earth. Rare Earth. And they've got yeah. a song called Ma. Ma. How's that? Beautiful. Ooh, how like? you it? Ian, I can't sing it. If, if I could, I would. <laughs> Or maybe I can't and I should because it <laughs> seems to me like the guys that can't can... sing make so much money in this country, right? I think you could rock a bass, oh, girl. I think you could rock some bass, they do. But thank you so much for joining thank us this morning. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for having me. Good luck for Pasella again. Exactly. I know it's a new season. And we'll catch it Friday night at 7.30, yeah? Thank you very much. We'll Thanks see you time. tomorrow bright and early South Africa. We love yeah. you, both. Too much, man. We wouldn't change a thing about you. Cheers. Bye. Adios, muchacho.